Hello there and welcome back. In this video we are going to learn how you can use FastAPI with Strawberry and um, <clears throat> let's jump right into it. So basically we would like to create a virtual environment and after the virtual environment is created we should activate it and pip install two packages. One which you need is the strawberry GraphQL uh, braces fast API package. And after that is installed, what we need to do, so this is the one, what we need to do is to install the debug server package. So this is the other one. And now what we can do is to create our fast API based one. Yeah, you will see that it complains, but it should work nevertheless. So we are going to create a main.py and here we need to import strawberry and from fast API we import the fast API and from strawberry that fast API we are going to import the graph ql router now we are able to create our strawberry type which is going to be a class of query and we will have a strawberry field which will have the hello function and it returns a string hello world and now we can create our schema from the strawberry dot schema with the query as argument and the graph ql app is going to come from the graph ql router with the schema and we have the application of the fast api and this should include router graphql app with the prefix graphql and that's basically it now if we go back to our console and clear the screen we should be able to use the uv corn main colon app dash dash reload to execute our web application and if we follow the route the default is going to return the not found but the graph ql should so the graph ql should return this window and we can execute the message and hello now if we go back we should see the hello world return so this is how easy it is to integrate it with fast api see you in the next